And I also know you stick to usually stick to cocktails and spirits in Mike's Mix, but today you're talking about beer. So this story brings together climate, sustainability, hmm. beer, and parties. It was just way too good to pass up. It's a new partnership between Minneapolis's Fair State Brewing, Asco Finlayson, and the Land Institute in Kansas that promises a new way to brew using an earth-friendly, cost-effective, and delicious Minnesota-grown grain called Kernza. Why have I never heard of Kernza before? Well, Kernza is, is an emerging idea. Um, in fact, the idea that agriculture can be part of the solution to the environmental crisis is itself an emerging idea. Adam Fetcher leads Asco Finlayson's Give 110% initiative. The company's promise to offset its carbon footprint and then some. It includes helping to turn climate-friendly grains into moneymakers for farmers. Kernza, a perennial wheatgrass developed by the Land Institute, is where they're starting. Typical commodity crops like wheat need to be tilled every single year. That tilling process not only damages the soil and strips it of its health, but also emits a lot of the carbon that's naturally trapped in soil. The idea of Kernza is not only reducing the harm that agriculture is doing to the planet, but actually reversing that impact and starting to really solve the problem. All right, Adam, show me the Kernza plant. Oh my gosh. The Kernza root is about 15 feet long, up to 15 feet long. And it's drought and flood tolerant, I would assume? Yeah, more so than wheat. The hope is that with a little nudge, the long-term gain of growing this crazy looking grain will outweigh the short-term challenge for everyone involved. At the end of the day, farmers need to feed their families and, and make enough money to stay in business. Absolutely, so that's why there's sort of a chicken and egg scenario going on with Kernza right now, where there's quite a lot of demand and quite a lot of excitement, but that transition for farmers is challenging, and that's why uh, we're really excited to help. Enter our Savior, the beer. We're already planning on uh, doing a Minnesota beer, and then we tied this into the uh, the Kernza into it because it just seemed like such a, a, a perfect fit. For President and CEO Evan Saley, experimenting with Minnesota grains like Kernza is sort of the whole point. We have been uh, here at Fair State really uh, excited and kind of devoted to trying to develop. Uh, Minnesota agricultural to support beer. It's always exciting for us to be able to work with new ingredients and see what they have to offer. And the Kearns is, certainly does kind of offer some of that earthy flavor that you kind of get from wheat. Let's talk about the beer. It's called Keep the North Cold? Yes. And what style of beer is it? It is a, uh, it's a golden ale. It's, uh, it's reasonably hoppy, but not like overly bitter. Mildly hoppy. Yep. I don't love a hoppy beer, but this is actually very drinkable for, for really anybody. So keep the North Cold beer, or they think they're going to shorten it to just North Cold beer, okay. uh, is uh, on tap now at Fair State Brewing and Bachelor Farmer. You can also try it in Asco Finlayson's Courtyard, part of an outdoor beer garden on January 31st. And then also coming up in May, there will be a limited run of cans that you can buy in liquor stores. If you want more information, it's posted at wcco.com slash links. Cans look cool.